All right, dear YouTubers, uh, this is another installment of Watch That Scooter Age. <laughs> we have now 88,888.8 kilometers. Um, the scooter is pretty much the same as it always was, <clears throat> but what has changed drastically is the license plate. It is no longer a Canadian one. I shipped the scooter last year from Canada, uh, last July, uh, to Europe. And I'm to explore Europe and those who have been watching the movies, there's already one of the scooter going over the Stelvio Pass in Italy. And right now I'm here in the area of Regensburg. Uh, this is a little village called Regenstauf. Um, which is sort of 20 kilometers away, 10 kilometers away from Regensburg. It is, as you would guess, at the river called Regen. And I'm about to finish up the last two kilometers um, to reach the goal. So we'll be doing the last two kilometers together. We have now 88,886.9. See you in a second. All right, off we go. It's a little bit cold, but very, very beautiful. So we have exactly one kilometer left. Beautiful little church coming up. Ah, gorgeous. So I'm gonna turn around so that we have a good spot to contemplate all the achievements of Scooty. Six point seven and eighty eight point eight. Beautiful. Eighty eight thousand eight hundred and eighty eight point eight. So we'll be making our traditional walkabout of the scooter. You can see a little bit of the river in the background. So, a couple of things about the scooter. Like I said, the scooter is pretty much the same. What has changed dramatically is the scenery around the scooter since I've been spending the first 80,000 in North America with it. And uh, there's still pretty much all the original parts in as listed in the last movie. With the one difference, those who have been watching my blogs and so on, you know that I 
did melt my gas gauge in Death Valley. It just got too hot and the little plate underneath started twisting and it couldn't move freely anymore. And I wanted to leave it as is, but um, in the end I, I, uh, the speedometer started causing some trouble. It got stuck at 70 kilometers uh, an hour. So I had to fix that and I had to break the seal of the speedometer and uh, fix everything. And it's working now the gas gauge. Watch this. There we go. So the scooter itself is pretty much the same as is. Um, the next really exciting thing will be at 99,999 kilometers. I will be driving to Podesta in Italy where the factory is, the Vespa factory that built the scooter. And uh, I will try to have the CEO um, of Vespa, uh, who should be in Podesta, uh, drive the last 100 meters uh, to round up the 100,000. So uh, stay tuned and goodbye.